I'm ATL. Hood life. ATL, ATL. Hood life. Who got the news? Who got the news? Who got the news? Who got the news? ATL, ATL. Hood life. Thank you for tuning in ATL Hood News. I'm your host, Greg Davis. Hey, look here. I know y'all heard of people who have uh, are sex addicts that have sex addict conditions. What about oral sex addict conditions? Okay, I have ran across a guy who has an oral sex addict condition, and I've never heard of it before. But you know, at any time, he may just feel what he loves and it just come out of him. You know what I'm saying? Y'all check it out right here on ATL Hood News. <laughs> That boy right there, like he had to taste for a waffle or something, didn't he? Ooh. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Oh, good old waffles right there, boy. But hey, we know he wasn't fiending for waffles. You know, he had, he was fiending for more like salmon. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And that's crazy though, man. Like, you know, you love it that much that you can't even keep your tongue in, in order. Your tongue is out of control. Boy, I tell you, boy. Uh, of some women on a nude beach will love him. That's all I gotta say. We'll be right back. <laughs> right after these meds. <laughs> or a sec. Well, I bet his jaw stay locked up. <laughs> Breaking news. Hey, we just got a 911 call in that said a woman is at a nearby hotel downtown Atlanta that stated that she's gonna peel her own cap back. News at six. And we're back. Hey, look here. Barney Mac, man, I love him. I really do. He's a stand-up guy, man. Hey, look, he is going to show not just us who's up and coming, the individuals out there in the, you know, out there uh, in the industry now, you know, professionals that's in the industry now, how to avoid Hollywood setups. Y'all check this out right here on ATL Hood News. <laughs> that's real. Daddy. I, I can't. No, no. Abby, isn't, isn't, isn't Jeremy on the other side? Me too, Where am I? I'm going to show you. Ow. All right, Bernie. Yeah. He's actually going to sit on her. On your no, left. no. No? Okay. Do we have another apple box? Let me put your show up. What are you told? What are you told? Huh? No, no, no. He ain't going to sit on my lap. That little nigga sit his ass back there. <laughs> Y'all ain't going to set me up. I don't blame him. Hey, they would have used it against him. Later on in the trial, they would have lied on him, and then they would have tried to have that video say, look, he was messing around with that little young boy. See how he had him on his lap? And what y'all would have did, America, y'all would have believed it like y'all believe everything else. So I don't blame him for telling that little boy to sit his ass on the side of me and don't sit on my lap. 100 <laughs> to Bernie Mac, my man. We still love you. R.I.P. to you, baby. Right here on ATL Hood News. Hey, look here. We'll be right back right after these messages. Breaking news. Man at a checkout at a local Walmart rings the alarm. News at six. <laughs> and we're back. Right here on the TL Hood News. Hey, look, y'all check this out, man. Disney, right? Made the Black Mermaid. Man, I love that because you know the mermaid always been white. I always wonder, why was it always white mermaids and never black mermaid but thank you disney for giving us the opportunity for us to be able to see the black mermaid now we've seen a black president now we've seen the black mermaid man we got it going on right about now and we can keep the police from stomping us down and, and, and shooting us and killing us uh we may be really over the border with that one now but i just wonder though like when they did when y'all did that wonder how it would look if it, if we had one of the old movies you know like back in the day one of the slave movies and we switched it around like that i just wonder how that would look
you gonna fetch me this fine morning like pennies from heaven java love <laughs> gather around gather around we have our auction dab this buck cracker this big buck cracker is very healthy very strong from western europe okay now that one had a little twist to it but that's kind of like what I'm talking about now, you know. Now, would that be considered historical <laughs> if it really was turned around like that, you know, like black people, a whole bunch of black people riding up the white people houses and setting up crosses and burning crosses and burning houses down and stuff like that. And we were the ones that, you know, represented the rebel flag and, you know, um, black clansmen, you know, in the city and stuff, you know, we wearing robes and stuff, we going out, you know, raping and shooting and doing all this crazy stuff to the white folk like they did to us back in the day. Hey, look here, man. All this shit crazy to me. You know, it just sounds good for the world out there in television, but in reality, that shit will never happen. It's going to be the way it is until we become B-E-A-D. It is what it is, baby. Hey, look here. Drop down to the description button below and make sure that y'all follow us. We greatly appreciate y'all support. Hey, look here. And y'all keep y'all head up and see y'all next time. Same place, same time, same channel, right here on ATL Hood Low. I love y'all. Peace. Man. ATL, ATL.